what's up everyone CVS and welcome to my video in this video it will be different as usual why because this is for assignment for the subject extensive reading so by the way I'm the sixth semester at Bali Bandung University so today I would like to present the something like review books as a reference that book I have read and the title of the book is The Root to Age Handbook of the Teaching English to the Young Learner. The author of the book is the Sue Gordon and the Fiona Copeland. The first published the book is 2019, so it's me last years ago. First question, where did you get it? Yeah, I get this book, it is from the Google. Of course, Google is free and there is a lot of book, but remember, it is not the ordinary Google. Why? It is the Google Scholar. So in the Google Scholar, you can found or you can search everything about reference, book as a reference. The next question, why you choose it? Hmm, it is easy because this is book. It is tell about how to teach English to the young learner as my reference. Yeah. The next question is, what makes you feel it relevant with your reading focus? I use this book because the reading focus it is about gain. Yeah, the reference on extensive reading. It is the improving the student skill by using digital game. It is mean RPG game, the role playing game. Because when I was younger, I don't know how to improving this the English skill speaking reading writing listening and of course everything about English skill and I, when I was playing game I can improve it for example when I am playing the game from the sword art online it is the RPG game and as you know the game is RPG so it's me every conversation it is the subtitle English yeah you can read, you can translate, and you can understand how the game will be played. Yeah, but as long as you play the game, you will know. And you can understand about that, and you can know about how to play the game, the rule, the quest, and another step on the game. On the game. And while you play the game, you can increase your English skill. And that's amazing. Yeah. As my experience. The next content is planning the content that become your main reference. In which page? As I ex explained before, yeah, the reason why I choose that book as a reference is because can improve the student English skill by using digital game. I found this on the page, and I have found a digital game on this book. On the page 306. Next question. What did experts say? It means what the explanation. So the explanation is according to Gordon Su and Complain Fiona, game can be considered a type of the play with the goal and rules. It means game have been by people all in the old culture to acquire various knowledge and the skill, the skill which is cognitive, social, emotion, and physical skill, as well as fun. The next content, the recommendation, another reference about reading books. Yeah, I have another reference that I haven't read. It is from the, what is the journal is mean? According to William, 2017, Digital game has been characteristic in a number of different ways. For example, they have a classic by genre action game, adventure game, role play game, RPG, and another genre game. So it means the player as will be, be, yeah, the student or the player, it will be increased by genre. And I use RPG role-play games is mean with the player will be 
play by single play game, multiplayer, and of course, it is the online game. You can communication with other people all around the world, but on the game with the English language. For the conclusion, if you want to increase something skill, such as English skill or Japanese skill, you can increase your skill by using a song, movie, game, or anything. Of course, as long as you want, as long as you have the purpose, it will be great. Yeah, it will be have some benefit for you. For example, yeah, I got to benefit from the, this game. First, I can get benefit such as English reading or English translation and all English skill. It's me. That is just for the presentation. I mean, it's like reviewing the book as a reference that I have read. So if there is the miss about something in this video, please forgive me. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're watching this video on YouTube. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Yo. Sometimes when we are vlogging like this, it is difficult because I never vlog. Let's cover time.